Good morning guys. I'm going to go make some breakfast. I'm going to go make some porridge. So I've just got myself some hot water with a green tea and lemon tea bag and an orange for snack. Then I've got one more banana to go on my porridge and then I've got like the rest of this smoothie to drink. Here's my porridge. It's just rolled Scottish oats with almond milk. Very yummy. I normally just put it in the microwave. Then the other day I tried it like cooking on the hob and it's so much more creamier. So now I'm like, this is the way to go. And here's the finished porridge. And then my green tea's just brewing over here. I'm now going to continue watching Survival of the Fittest because I started watching it last night, but then it kind of like started to crash. And then I just got sleepy, so I turned it off. But um, I'm going to continue watching this. Okay, so I'm all just in my gym 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 gear this jumper is just to wear to the gym because it's raining outside not because i'm gonna wear this whilst i'm working out because i'll be sweating um but yeah anyway i thought because i'm like all ready to go i mean i still have like an hour to wait to go to the gym because like you have to kind of wait a certain amount of time after you've had food to go to the gym otherwise you'll get like stomach ache and stuff like that so i thought i'd just get dressed and stuff now but i thought i'd tell you what the plan is and why i'm vlogging so this week we have like a week of uni it's kind of like a half term kind of thing um although later on i do have to go in to meet my tutor just to run through like stuff in your future and all that jazz um but yeah so because it's a week off i thought because i didn't go home at all in first semester until like the christmas holidays i thought i'd treat myself and come home this week but the thing is maddie my sister does not know i'm coming down so i'm like surprising her which is super exciting my dad's gonna pick me up from the station because she's staying over there tonight and he's gonna pretend that he's getting mcdonald's i think that's the plan he's gonna come pick me up unless we're getting mcdonald's as well i feel like if he's saying we're getting mcdonald's then we're gonna get mcdonald's it's just gonna be so nice to come home so i'm gonna go to the gym only for like a half an hour 45 minutes um just so i can get some sort of exercise in and then i'm gonna come back here get ready for uni make sure i'm all packed and then i'm going to walk to uni have my meeting and then walk straight to the train station where i'm going to get my train home here's to this week right guys we're about to go to the gym i'm really not feeling it just because it's raining outside and it's just like mm, uh, i'm just going to speed walk my way there i mean fortunately it's like only two minutes away but still why right guys i'm all ready to go i've got my suitcase packed i've got my bag over there for uni so let's do this in the rain. So I've just come out of my um, meeting, I'm in uni now and I'm probably gonna go before someone comes down this corridor. <laughs> so I'm now walking to the train station. I'm hoping the trains aren't gonna be too busy because it's a weekday and not a weekend, but then again, it is half term. So yeah, we're just gonna have to see, but yeah, got my suitcase. Everything you said, they already knew, more or less. Well, here's something that you didn't know. So we've just arrived at Plymouth and I've got about just over half an hour left of my journey when I first got the train it was so busy. I'm so excited to finally arrive and I'm so hungry. Look at it! <laughs> Wait, I'm just sitting in the back of her! <laughs> yeah! Oh, oh man! <laughs> I just thought I'd come down like Do you know treat what? myself. <laughs> So we've just come to Cornwall Surf Station to get that McDonald's. See, I was right. I knew we were going to get McDonald's. Treat myself. Oh, sorry, Dad. Walking into you. Getting them ketchup pots ready. <laughs> so I have Fanta, medium chips, six chicken nuggets, and a Big Mac. I never normally get Big Mac, but yeah, yum. Guys, this is so exciting. I just booked tickets to do a weekend camping at Ballbusters. I'm so excited. It's my first time going to a festival. At the moment, I've got two of my flatmates on board. I've mentioned it to the rest of the group, but um, so far, me, Rob and Courtney have actually bought our tickets. But yeah, this is so exciting. I cannot wait. We're watching some Winter Olympics. This is the first time I've actually 
watched it. I haven't seen any of it at uni, but it's nice to come home and watch some. Your teeth look really <laughs> As you can see, Maddie's tanned herself up. We're about to leave and it's raining outside, of course. Oh no, it's raining. You're recording. No. If, it, if you are, it doesn't matter, but can you show them how good my ankles look? Okay, yeah. Do you were? Yeah, yeah, look how good they look. Like, oh, I wish it was just an ankle. Hey. Hey, Apple. Hey! Hey, Orange! Hey, Orange! <laughs> How are you feeling about this mess? Well, obviously not okay. You're such a snake. <laughs> oh, hi, friend. Oh, I like this song. I have this song on my phone. Bye. Yeah. Got any eggs up there? <laughs> Got any eggs? <laughs> Got any grapes? And a mountain lawn like I told you today. I'll pass. <laughs> and water it away. Why water away? Miley. Hello. Look who's back. Look who's back. Miley, don't hide from me. Um, this is not how you treat a guest. Rude. Rude. Just hanging with your other cat friends, I see. All right, I get you. Me and Vanny have now arrived back at our mom's. Just look, I've come back, well, apart from the stuff I've just dumped on my bed, but I've come back to a lovely tidy room. Oh my God. So thank you very much, mum, for that. Um, anyway, we didn't have pancakes yesterday. I'm gonna go make some now. I mean, we did have McDonald's, so I doubt I would have even had room. I've just come down to the kitchen and hope to find pancake ingredients. And yes, we have the ingredients to make the pancakes, but topping wise, we have a banana, but no Nutella. I mean, come on, why doesn't this household have Nutella? And then we have sugar, but no lemons. So, looks like pancakes for me isn't on the cards. Um, I'm just gonna have to try and find some other snacks, aren't I, Marley? She does not care. It's one o'clock, I'm hungry. Let's get some lunch going. There we go. Let's get ready. Nice. And here we have it. No, sorry Kitty, this isn't for you, mate. Right, after finishing that lovely lunch, I'm now going to get some clothes on my suitcase, 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 and have a shower. I'm a seat right now. Can you, Molly? Look at these Molly. cuties. Oh. I know I was thinking as well. Let's put on tip heating. So I've just come out the shower, and I'm now putting on the kettle. I'm gonna have a green tea, and then guess man's just gonna have a normal regular cup of tea. Is that right, Mads? Sweet stuff. Maddie's got her tea. I've got my tea. And I'm enjoying these biscuits way too much. Tea like Maddie's that nails because I'm such a good dinner. sister. Sorry about my beautiful nails. And we are done. Look at those beautiful red nails. I feel like I should be rewarded now with a, you know, chance on the TV. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You're gonna have the whole TV to yourself soon. Anything else I need to know? Yeah, but I'll be lonely. Exactly. So what are you asking to change the channel? Yeah, but you can watch it with me. No. Look, he's come to join me. You're getting snug on my lap again. Anyway, I've been watching Stubbs go dating. I've nearly caught up now. I've literally got the tiniest bit to go, and it's raining outside but it's making me feel really cosy. Do you like the camera? Right, so I'm gonna put on tea now. My mum, very kindly, when she got home from work, got me some lemons and some eggs so I can make myself pancakes. So because it's Valentine's Day, I'm the only one that's gonna be in this household because everyone else is off out. So yeah, I'm cooking myself a meal for one. I've got a chicken pie in the oven. I'm gonna make some mashed potato 
with some peas and gravy and I'm going to finish off by making these pancakes and then I've also got some chocolates so can you get any better let's just look at this incredible candle like how big is this like can you see that's my hand and that's this candle it's got five wicks inside I'm in love and then you've got like all this plant tree stuff going on let's see what is on said TV oh I hear a bell Yes. What's oh hey kitty Oh hi Right let's Nothing check out The guide That's it, from? leave me like everyone else <laughs> I think I might just put on Netflix You know I've got another episode of First Dates Hotel to watch so I'm going to put that on instead That is so good Honestly like First Dates Is so lovely but the First Dates Hotel I'm just loving this series Like it's so cute. There we go, guys. My chicken pie with peas and homemade mash and gravy. I've pulled it out the bag and I'm excited to tuck in. Are you jealous? Molly took the key for the front door, so I had to put Molly outside the window in our dining room. And look at her, she's just waiting for her pals. You're waiting for your friends. Anyway, I am now the last person in the house. I'm lonely. Um, but I have just been a very good girl and I've tidied up the kitchen apart from this I've got a tiny bit of mash left, but I'll probably just eat that later There's no point in, like putting it in the fridge because it's literally like a mouthful Um, but I've tidied this away. I've emptied the dishwasher and I've reloaded it. I'm just an angel, you know Right guys, I have pre-made my pancake mixture. I've got the butter bubbling Let's do this. Okay, let's hope this works. I know there is that thing of like the first pancake is always, you know, the worst. Let's just give it a go. Just waiting now. Yeah, okay. Um, first pancake fail is definitely a thing or a thing for me. This always happens. I feel like it's because the pan always has to be used first. And then after that, it's fine. So let's hope the second one goes better. Right, here we go, attempt two. It's not perfectly circular, but at the moment, I just want to try and get a full shape and not that <laughs> I'll still eat it though okay it broke but no joke that looks way better by the end of this I'm gonna be a pro all right I'll get one perfect pancake guys we have our first circular pancake oh my god yes see yeah, I told you it looks a mess but I did it in the end and I'm proud of myself and I just honestly I just want to eat hello I'll tell you what at the end of the day yes presentation is the key but it all comes down to what it tastes like and these taste amazing right so i've now come into my bedroom I've got myself a cup of tea ever since i've tried to be healthy i've just been having like green teas and fruit teas and stuff like that so yeah treating myself and then i've also got some chocolates which my mom kindly bought me um yeah i think what i'm gonna do is watch some stuff on my laptop and then um if i'm still like awake i'm gonna go downstairs and watch the Winter Olympics because it starts at midnight. But yeah, we'll just see how the evening goes. Good morning, guys. So it is 10 to 11. I've been up for like the last two hours. Um, I set my alarm for like 10 past nine. And then about like half eight, I could hear Marley meowing outside my door. So I let her in. And then by that point, I was already awake. So I've just been watching the Winter Olympics for like the last hour or so. I've also made some more pancake mix. I'm gonna make some more. I won't show you me cooking them this time because you've already witnessed that, but um, hopefully the first one will be way better now. But yeah, anyway, I thought I'd update you with what I'm doing this morning. Are you enjoying watching the Olympics, Marley? <laughs> Smashed every pancake. I don't have a single fail. So, as you can see, I've gotten myself ready. I've done my makeup, done my hair, and then for my outfit, this jumper is from New Look, and then I've got these high-waisted trousers from ASOS. But the reason why I've got myself all ready is because in the next hour, I want to film my Year 8 art book, Part 2, which is really exciting because I haven't seen inside that book in so long. So, yeah, I'll get that video up for you guys, but yeah. That's my day. I'm still watching the Olympics. It is Great Britain versus China in the women's curling. At the moment we're losing, but I'm hoping we can pull it back together. Um, and also, 
Just look at this beautiful sky. I'm loving it, especially after yesterday's weather. <gasps> look, he's been an angel and made me pasta. <laughs> Favorite. Oh, thanks, Mats. You legend. Also, update on GB. Um, they're winning now by one point. Let's hope the winning drive continues. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Right, I've just finished filming my final sketchbook video. I cannot believe like I'm done with them now. Kind of sad. But I said in the video that I need to get back and try and think of some new arty videos that I can do. But anyway, yeah, I don't know when that video is going to go up. Um, it's going to go up after this vlog. I'm going to probably go back downstairs and watch some more Olympics because I have nothing else to do. You know you and your best friend are friendship goals when you find out you can both get the same train home on Sunday. Literally what I said to her just now, you've made my journey home. How long that number is time is better. Bish, bash, bosh. Also for the last half hour I've had this little... <laughs> sleeping kitty just watch me on my laptop she's literally just sat up like dozing off and i'm just thinking like girl you can sleep you know <laughs> my chin is so red it's getting hot in here i'm gonna make myself a cup of tea yeah so guys it's the evening and i'm sad and bad I'm literally just watching stuff on my laptop, nothing exciting, just catching up on the, you know, TV episodes and stuff. I don't understand, but for the last few nights, my eye has been really itchy and irritated. Like, it's bringing me back to childhood Kiana when I used to get really bad irritated eyes and I would just itch and itch, but then you itch and it feels so good, even though it's really bad. But I'm so surprised, I said this earlier, touch wood, that I haven't woken up with swollen eyes because I used to all the time if I got an itchy irritated eye I'd wake up in the morning and it'd be so swollen and like red and like bleh. um but yeah fortunately I haven't woken up um with that yet although I'm trying to be really careful like I'm just doing like that trying not to you know annoy it too much but yeah anyway I think I might say good night now I don't think anything else exciting is gonna happen this evening but yeah anyway i guess i'll see you tomorrow good night so i've just come into costa to meet my dad and i've just got myself a gingerbread latte because even though it's not on the menu it's unlike you can still kind of get it if they still the syrup so yum in my turn i have just come back from churro um, i met my mum after she finished work and she took me home so i don't have to get the train i'm really done with trains at the moment because i'm just a bit sick of trains um but i only went and picked myself up a pasty you do not know how excited i am i've got a mark on my oh um you don't know how excited i am to eat this pasty right now they're just like i only ever have them when i'm in cornwall because you know it's just not the same i feel bad buying a cornish or so-called cornish pasty not in cornwall so yummy okay you can't see me right now but you're talking Okay, I'm talking my mouth for one minute. Let me just swallow. Also, if you record me in my past, I'll be So, I was just sat at the table, eating my food, and then I was like, oh, Mads, your pasty looks really good, because, like, loads of the, um, like, gravy and stuff is still inside. I'm not inside. giving you permission for this. You can put this on YouTube, I can. Okay. I'll blow your face. You. <laughs> um, and then she goes... What did you say? Like, I hate how you're so happy all the time. <laughs> what, this is Maddie? Yeah, she just said, I hate how you're so happy all the time. But then she said, I don't know how you do it. <laughs> I don't know. Just cheerful character. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. It's because I'm eating a pasty. Hey guys, it's the next day. <laughs> and I'm shading my face because I've got the sun beaming on me. It's actually really warm. I thought I was going to freeze, so I've got like two jumpers on and this jacket. But yeah, we're off to Plymouth today, if you can see my face. They're excited. We've got a rainbow. Oh, it's like a full one. It goes all the way over there. 
We're just exiting Cornwall now, heading over the bridge to Plymouth. mad how beautiful it is today like actually feels like a summer day i'm so happy so we're on our way to house of fraser all right <laughs> anyway we're going to house of fraser now let's cut that conversation and then we're gonna do have a look in there just skipping oh, the conversation puppy. honestly think we're gonna like our seventh escalator right now yeah. like this is giving me hamley's vibes almost died on every single one of them. and there's an look there's another one i think this is the final one though is this just for a toilet? Yeah, there's a restaurant up here. Okay. Wait, you're making us come up here for the toilet? I did say where I was going, you two didn't have to follow me. Come up to the top, get a nice view of Plymouth. Got a nice little surface going on. Very cool, got some cranes. I'm gonna join Maddie over at the table. So, we've decided to eat here now. I... <laughs> I have gone for a free range egg and crust sandwich because <laughs> it's my one of my favourite like fillings with a grapefruit and cranberry juice. That's gone from lasagna, which looks really good. And then mum's gone for like salad and quiche. Yeah. <laughs> We're currently in Debenhams at the moment in quiz clothing. I'm looking at bridesmaids, well not bridesmaids, wedding dress like occasion dresses. <laughs> I'm talking to the camera. Right, I thought I was talking to her. I was looking for your camera, but you weren't holding it. Yeah, no, I was like, I'll position it up, do a little chat. Yeah, Maddie, we think we found Maddie's dress. Mine, it's the one. Yeah, mine's arrived at home. Hopefully, when I get back, I'll try it on, and it's the perfect one. So excited. Here we have it, stopped in M&S Cafe, got myself a tea and a jam and cream scone can you get any more cornish i think not if i had a pasta i'd have the complete package so we're just walking back to the train station now we've finished um i only bought like two things myself <laughs> what are you doing i just ran in <laughs> no she was running like this <laughs> mum wants a little bit of a hello <laughs> No, I didn't need to drop it because I was always not into it for my dear life. Um, God, it's a bit windy now. And yeah, just bought things for the wedding. That was mainly what today was about and we succeeded. So yeah, it's done, it's done. So we are now back home. It was so weird, like when we got off the train, it was pouring with rain. That just rhymed. <laughs> um, so yeah, it was crazy because it's been such a lovely day. Oh, you can see myself in the mirror. Hey. Um, yeah, it's been such a lovely day. And then we come back and it's like rain. I keep saying rain and train. I'm gonna stop. I mean, to be honest, I did kind of see some like really dark looking clouds. Um, so yeah, we were so lucky with the weather today. Great success. Um, I just got home to try on the dress. Oh my God, why am I rhyming? Train, rain, success and dress. Okay, I need to stop. The dress that I ordered for my brother's wedding, I just tried it on and I'm in love with it. And the shoes and the bag I bought today match so well. Sorry, I've got a bit of an itchy nose. So yeah, I'm absolutely so happy. Well, that, um, we were gonna go and watch The Great Showman, which I've been dying to watch for so long. When we get there, tickets sold out. Like honestly, it's been out for ages and it's still selling out. Like the woman at the counter was saying that it's booked, like honestly. I'll just have a look at it. Also, I bought a new watch from New Look. It was literally, cost me like 11 pounds, something like just under 12 pounds with a student discount. Um, I've been wanting a watch for quite some time. Was looking more at like the grey and pink tones. Saw this one, tried it on and I fell in love, like gold and mustard, love it. So I got that. And I also bought myself another Lizelle product, um, another cleanse and polish. I bought the bigger 200ml one because just saves money rather than keep on buying the 100 mil. So yeah, I've had a great day. Anyway, I've got a bit of uni work to do. So I'm gonna do that, have a chill evening, have some food and then just pack all ready for tomorrow. So it's leaving day. Oh, there goes the train. That's not my train though. I don't, no, it's not my train. I still have like another 20 minutes before I need to make a move. But I've come to say goodbye to Piglet. Hi Piglet, hello. Hello cutie. Hello. Come on. Hello. 
I will see you at Easter time. Oh, you're so warm. Goodbye, my cherub. Bye-bye. Goodbye, room. Oh, I just ran under my bed. See you in Easter. Come on, Marley. Come on. Come on, I'm going now. Okay, so I've been on the train for like the last hour looking at my new watch. Um, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I've had such... <laughs> so we're doing this on the train. I've had such a lovely week. It's a nice bath. Look at that.